part 12, skincare treatments. Whenever lifestyle changes and anti-aging skincare products have not produced the results you're after, medical treatments may be the next step. Medical procedures performed by a doctor, an esthetician, or a cosmetic dermatologist can have uh, great effects by stimulating new collagen growth, for example. Um, medical professionals may help you preserve skin elasticity more effectively than other options. In this section, we'll take a look at some of the more popular skincare treatments that you need to know about. The first is laser treatment. Laser treatment is usually considered less invasive and low risk compared to other medical treatments for skin aging. Laser treatments can significantly improve the signs of aging. Studies show that laser therapy helps stimulate the production of collagen in the skin's connective fibers. Increased collagen improves the look of the skin and increases its natural elasticity. It also improves the look of wrinkles. Laser treatments can also be used to treat chronic skin care uh, conditions like psoriasis and eczema. During laser uh, therapy, the skin will be prepped with a numbing cream and the process is usually painless. Um, for laser treatments, it's normal to experience redness and swelling. Possible risks are rare and include infection and scarring. The next thing we talk about is IPL. Photofacial IPL is also known as IPL photo rejuvenation or photofacials. Before we get into the reasons why an IPL photofacial might be an option for your client, let's cover the basics of why this might be appropriate um, as a suggestion. Uh, let's go into what this treatment is, what it does, and some of the anticipated results. When you think about IPL, Generally, IPL, intense pulsed light therapy, is used to treat sun damage, wrinkles, stretch marks, and age spots. Treatments are performed at med spas, doctor's offices, estheticians, and they can be used to erase mild sun damage, um, age spots, freckles, or irregular pigmentation on the face or neck or, or chest or other parts of the body. IPL treatments can also be used for hair reduction, but uh, multiple treatments might be necessary, and this is not appropriate for certain hair color, skin pigmentation, and other situations. These treatments should always, always be done by a skilled and licensed professional. Many clients say that IPL treatments and the benefits they see are worth every penny, but in our experience, like most treatments, many of the benefits are dependent on the skill level and experience of the technician. So let's explore some of the benefits that might be had in, in terms of client goals. Uh, first of all, the cost of IPL. If the cost of skincare treatments is a consideration, IPL is a fabulous option. The primary reason that this is a great option is that IPL is often uh, very inexpensive compared to other uh, treatments. IPL, photofacial treatments, often cost less than laser treatments because they take minutes to perform. Most treatment areas are often done in minutes, and the areas also provide um, results for long-term um, results, unlike a typical or regular facial does. Uh, the other thing is there's practically no downtime. Most facial treatments are providing similar results, typically have a few days of downtime. Um, they're completed in an average of 15 to 30 minutes uh, per session. They're quick. Additionally, other than a bit of redness and a bit of heat sensation, most people can continue seamlessly with their lives with no downtime. While IPL isn't necessarily promoted as an anti-aging solution, it does have lasting effects in helping reduce the signs of aging, such as wrinkles, sunspots, unevenness, discoloration, and other primarily, primarily highly visible indicators of aging. And most important, by treating a deeper layer of the skin, uh, IPL stimulates collagen growth and it also improves the skin's texture, reducing the appearance of fine lines and wrinkles. It's important to note that studies have proved that IPL stimulation has been shown to stimulate collagen growth after one treatment and continues to do so for some time after the treatment's ended. IPL can also be used throughout the body. Most clients uh, tend to start on the facial area, but once they start to see results, they tend to travel to other problem areas like the neck, the shoulders, the hands, the arms, and the chest. IPL treatments can address anywhere that you have skin 
or um, anticipated skin care problems. The anticipated results for photofacial rejuvenation that tend to be very good and excellent in most clients. So IPL can be used in conjunction with other treatments and IPL is client friendly in that IPL photo rejuvenation processes can be done concurrently with other treatments because IPL treatments target the deeper layers of the skin and not the surface. As such, IPL can safely be performed with other treatments such as microdermabrasion, chemical peels, and other facial skin treatments since these others specifically target the outermost layer of the skin. It can also help repair small blood vessels. When a client states they want to reduce broken capillaries and lessen the appearance of blood vessels on the face, or skin, IPL might be an excellent way to do so. If your client has small blood vessels that have become visible or enhanced sunspots or any unevenness in coloring or evidence of sun damage or irregularities in pigmentation, IPL might be a great solution to help reduce their appearance or even clear up their skin. IPL can inhibit and control rosacea and acne as well. For many clients with the goal of clearing up their skin, and clearing up acne or reducing rosacea or inflammation, IPL would certainly be something to try or to suggest. If your client does suffer from rosacea or breakouts or severe acne, or if they tell you that they're going to or are experiencing issues combating redness and inflammation caused by acne, then IPL treatments can probably help. In many cases, IPL um, actually helps to eliminate large pores and thus reduce the appearance on participant skin. These results were studied excluding the application of any additional topical products. IPL can help with precancerous cells in patients with heavy sun damage and precancerous spots um, and active keratoses. IPL may be combined with blue light or photodynamic therapy, PDT, in several independent studies, it's been shown that this greatly reduces the number of precancerous lesions, sun damage, and also improves the texture of the skin by stimulating collagen growth. IPL can reduce ruddiness and patches of redness. If your client's been diagnosed with rosacea or any other types of skin condition that diffuses redness into the skin, IPL photofacial therapies are great treatment solutions for reducing the appearance of ruddiness, redness, and discoloration, red patches, and helps create a natural complexion. Another great thing about IPL is that uh, most people say there's no pain. While a small percentage of clients expressed a feeling, uh, a slight tingling sensation during the procedure, roughly 90% of clients say that they've had no pain at all during the IPL photo treatment. In explaining what discomfort some had, you can tell your clients that people say that if you do experience slight discomfort, applying a topical cream that's a painkiller 60 minutes prior to the procedure can easily reduce this. Additionally, after treatment, most clients say that the treated area feels warmer than normal, but some say the heat is uncomfortable for about 15 to 30 minutes post-treatment. This is easily solved by using a cold pack or a chilled uh, cloth for a few minutes. Now let's talk about microneedling with radio frequency. Microneedling can um, have significant improvements in skin quality and texture. While this is minimally invasive as a procedure that helps build collagen, um, this procedure can not only tighten the skin, but also help with fine lines and large pores wrinkles, acne, stretch marks, etc. Um, special needles that deliver high intensity radio frequency energy are inserted into the targeted tissue in the skin, which gives a uniform warming effect to the deep tissue and stimulates new collagen fibers to grow. Improvement is seen three to six months after the procedure, and most people get two to three treatments. What about all therapy as an option? All therapy is a non-invasive procedure that uses microfused ultrasonic waves to stimulate collagen growth in the body and tighten the skin. It works by generating a thermal effect under the skin, which jumpstarts the body's collagen production. 
your healthcare provider will use ultrasound to visual, visualize the layers of your skin during the procedure to ensure the right amount of, of energy is directed in the right area. People who undergo all therapy usually see results in two to three months. They may also see improvement in their skin after six months and the results may last for a year or more. Uh, let's talk about chemical peels. Chemical peels are usually performed on the face and the neck and the hands. Chemical peels improve uh, signs of aging like age spots and wrinkles as well. There are different degrees of chemical peels and while some are high strength peels and that they, they can actually be done at home like Ellie Glow's 40% Rapid Exfoliator, there are a lot that are lower chemical peels and higher chemical peels as well. What's important to note is that chemical peels that are at strengths that are very high are usually performed and recommended by licensed professionals. To improve elasticity, most skincare coaches will most likely recommend light to medium peels. Deep chemical peels penetrate deep into the skin are usually used to treat scars or precancerous growth, and these are not the norm. During a chemical peel, your practitioner will apply a chemical solution to your face. The solution works as an exfoliant and it removes the top layers of the skin. When the skin pushes and grows more uh, cells underneath, the new collagen is triggered, leaving you with a smoother, um, lighter and younger looking and more youthful looking skin. As with any medical procedure, chemical peels come with some risks. After the peel, it's usually uh, normal to experience skin redness, inflammation and peeling depending on the strength of the peel. This inflammation process is what triggers new skin and collagen growth. Scarring and infection are rare, but possible. The DIY rapid exfoliation peels are extremely safe, but you must do a patch test and it's highly recommended that a skincare coach, an esthetician or a doctor teach the client how to use them by example prior to using them at home. Buffered chemical peels can be a great addition in a DIY. That's particularly why Ellie Glow uses a 40% buffered glycolic acid peel for a DIY option for clients. For the price of one bottle that can last about a year of treatments that they would do ideally once um, every four weeks to six weeks initially and then twice a month, it would cost the same amount in an esthetician or doctor's office. And what we recommend is doing these peels on a regular basis and saving the money to do um, treatments that cannot be done at home. And uh, that's a great option for clients. Uh, we highly recommend that the skincare coach show and tell the product. So you show your client what it does. You make sure that a patch test is done and that they understand um, how to use the product properly. It's a great benefit for being um, in a coaching engagement for a client. Now let's talk about dermabrasion. Dermabrasion can improve the look of wrinkles and skin sagging. It can also be used for acne, scarring, age spots, precancerous growth. And it's another exfoliation technique performed by a dermatologist or a plastic surgeon or an esthetician. Uh, for dermabrasion, your healthcare provider will use a tool to abrade the skin, removing the outer layers. Studies have found that dermabrasion is more effective at stimulating new collagen growth than chemical peels. Dermabrasion comes with risks. Um, infection is possible and people with darker skin tones are more likely to experience scarring and permanent pigment changes. Um, now let's talk about platelet-rich plasma injections. Platelet-rich plasma injection is a relatively new cosmetic um, procedure that for the last few years has been shown to aid in wound healing after surgery or in trauma. The treatment involves drawing blood from you and separating your own platelets and growth factors. The platelet cells clot in your blood um, so when your skin is cut, but they have other benefits as well. 
Platelets actually contain proteins and growth factors that can heal the skin and promote collagen production. Once the platelets and the growth factors are separated from the rest of your blood, they can be injected into your face, neck, or hands. These cells then stimulate new cell growth and healing. Following the injection or the platelet-rich plaza, um, fibroblasts in the skin are triggered, which leads to new cells and collagen production. A hot topic is fillers. Certain fillers like Sculptra and Radis stimulate the body to make collagen. Sculptra contains polylactic acid, which can stimulate poly, uh, collagen production and tighten the skin. Your healthcare provider will inject uh, the filler at different points of the client's face, and the procedure takes about uh, 20 to 30 minutes to complete. The solution of the filler fills hollow areas and deep folds the skin, and the results are usually notable, noticeable um, after about a month, but three to four sculpture treatments might be required for optimal results. For the best results, you might need to do one to three treatments in the first year, then one treatment about every 12 to 18 months to retain, to maintain the results. That's what they recommend. Clients as they age often want to know about cosmetic surgery. Cosmetic surgeries to address wrinkles and skin sagging include facelift, brow lift, neck lift, and other areas. Um, the procedures are done by plastic surgeons and they make incisions into the skin. The skin um, is then lifted and the underlying muscle is addressed. The skin um, gets, the excess skin gets trimmed away and the incisions are closed with sutures. These surgeries provide a lifted and tighter look to the effective skin. Cosmetic surgery carries all of the risks of any surgery, like infection and scarring. It does most often require general anesthesia, which also involves risk. Talk to your healthcare provider about the risks and potential benefits to make the right decision for you. Hormone therapy. As we age, our hormone levels naturally decline and this leads to changes in the skin. Uh, falling hormones are to blame for skin thinning and dryness as well as sagging. Hormone therapy seeks to improve skin thickness and hydration, leading to plumper, fuller skin. Hormone replacement therapy is being studied and there are serious side effects to be aware of. Uh, so look to see the benefits and the risk of any of these suggestions for your clients. Again, your job is to educate and discuss, but never, ever, ever to make the decision for the client.